By rail is coming to the northern suburbs with a one kilometre line to be built through Reservoir. The decision has divided locals who've campaigned for years to get rid of the boom gates. A suburb decades divided is about to be united by getting rid of this shocking rail crossing and run-down station at Reservoir. But the road and rail separation and a new station with a landmark canopy and public plaza comes at a cost. The government's opted for SkyRail, one kilometre of it, nine metres high, rather than the more expensive option of a rail trench. It gives us this opportunity to make this new plaza open space, which will provide for better connections. Locals in the Labor stronghold are divided. John Goatley has lived in Reservoir for 51 of his 81 years. It's intrusive into the skyline. There's nothing else bigger around here at all. And uh, it would be much better if it was below ground. It won't look too crashed up for the people living in the area because you'll see a train come past and plus all the vandalism downstairs. But others support the elevated rail and want the intersection fixed. It is an abomination and something should have been done by, about it by now. It's better than what we've got now. This intersection has been rated Melbourne's third worst with 36,000 cars a day trying to pass through it. And the boom gates, well, they're down about 20% of the time during the morning peak. It will create many opportunities to open up uh, reservoir and allow for the east-west movement between the two activity centres here. The project will take more than a year. Most of the locals will speak to me, really want it done yesterday. Brendan Donahue, 7 News.